these are the few cue cards, new cue cards we've come across. I would like you, each one of you to speak. Okay. So who's going to speak first? Um, are these new cue cards or? And these are new cue cards, beta. Okay. Okay. Why are you asking this again and again? Um, uh, because I have not prepared all the cue cards and I don't know about these cue cards. So nobody knows, na? First time I'm showing them to everybody. Okay? Okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Okay. All right. Ma'am, can you please uh, show all cue cards once again? Yes, ma'am. Okay, one is this in front of you. Note it down? Yes, ma'am. This is a public facility that has been renovated and improved. Just a minute. Click the pictures. Done, ma'am. Okay. The next one is a skill you enjoyed as a teenager or learned as a teenager. Okay. All right. You picked up something that was thrown by somebody else. An unusual holiday. All right? Yes, ma'am. And uh, and please uh, say, say, send this in the chat box for those students who haven't noted them down. Okay? So that everybody comes to know. <coughs> Sorry. All right. Um, anybody who would like to speak? I actually don't want to show what is what I have written. So yeah. I'll display this one. Okay. Now, who's going to speak at number one? iPhone. Who is iPhone? I'm going to remove you unless you change your name or speak out your name. Who is that? iPhone. See, then you will not be able to enter. Once I remove you, you can speak out your name. I'll rename you here. Tell me who you are. All right. Yes, who's going to speak at number one? Um, may I, ma'am? Yes, Preeti, of course. Okay. I would like to speak at a person who is good at making uh, people feel welcome. All right. Yeah. So, um, I have visited a lot of people at their home, but uh, today I would like to talk about uh, a person. Uh, her name is Urmila. She is around 55 years and... Uh, I met her uh, in Hyderabad accidentally, but uh, after a few time, we became uh, very close to each other and we started talking on mobile phones. We she usually invites me at her home and uh, uh, she welcomes everyone with a happy face whenever I visit her. She has a uh, a very bright happy face and with open arms she welcomes me and she hugs me tightly and uh, also uh, i would like to talk about her that she is a, she is a very successful woman she worked as a principal uh, for around 30 years and uh, she is very positive person full of energy and whenever i feel uh, down during my uh, uh, lifetime I usually uh, consults with her she give me perfect advice and motivates me to do something great in my career and uh, she, are, she also uh, tells me that there will be a lot of difficulties in life but you have to face them and don't be negative about anything so I think she makes me feel uh, energetic and positive about the life so, uh, she is the person uh, who motivates me. That's all, ma'am. Very nice. 
very nice a new cue card immediately you you know you spoke and that is uh, not bad at all okay let me see what is the cue card who's good at making people feel welcome is in in his or her home uh, preeti you did a good job preeti which group are you in online group ma'am academic ha uh, academic group okay so you are taking the writing feedbacks from me right yes ma'am all right all right so preeti a little bit of your pronunciation has to be corrected okay um you say c c it is she bolo sh she ha ah, it's she and then uh, i'll i'll replay okay. i would like to speak at the person who is good at making i would like to speak at ni hota i would like to speak about ya speak of okay okay will feel welcome all right so um i have visited a lot of people at their home see but... it is not lot of what should it be you correct yourself many people lot of law 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 okay 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 not lot of lot of okay okay today i would like to talk a talk about the uh, not talk what is it talk talk to oh to are you from punjab <laughs> haryana ma'am haryana do you know punjabi o o ki matra ek o ki hoti hai ek o ki hoti hai hindi mein okay okay so it's talk talk about okay um her name is urmila she is around 55 years she she nahi she is around 55 years okay Okay. Let's say fifty-five. You don't need to put the word years after fifty-five. She's around fifty-five. Okay. Okay. So, I met her uh, in Hyderabad accidentally, but uh, after a few time we became uh, very close to. Okay. It. Can you count time? No. No. Who is used with countable things? Okay. Okay. Few you cannot use with time. Okay. After some time. Okay. Okay. Together and we started talking on mobile phone. It is not talking; it's talking. Oh, bolo. Talking. No. Again wrong. Again speak. Talking. No. Talk. Talking. Talking. Can anybody else say the word talking? Talking. Talking. See, Harpreet has said talking. Saman. Yes, ma'am. Talking, talking. Yes, ma'am. Ah, uh, Preeti, say it again. Talking. Yes, now it's correct. Okay. Okay. She usually invites. She नहीं है. She. Okay. She okay. usually invites. At her home, and uh, uh, she welcomes everyone with a. She नहीं. She. Okay. Okay. Whenever I visit her, she has a very bright, happy face, and with open arms, she welcomes me and she hugs me tightly. And so, also, wherever you had said she in place of she, it will be counted a pronunciation error, even though the same word is being repeated. It will be counted as a pronunciation error, and twenty five percent weightage is on pronunciation in the IELTS speaking. Okay. Okay, ma'am. Got it. So you have to work on the your shares. Okay, there is a very important what you call it. क्या कहते हैं उसको? She sells sea shells on the sea shore. Okay, what are these called? Tongue twisters. She sells sea shells on the sea shore. You have to speak it again and again and again. And uh, you have to get it right every time. It will improve your sure and sir. Wherever sir has to come, it has to be sir. She sells. She is she. S H E sells sea shells. S E A C then shells <laughs> on the sea shore. Again, it is S E A C and S H O R E shore. Okay. So try these this uh, tongue twister and you'll feel uh, you'll learn this uh, pronunciation better. So uh, I would like to talk about her that she is 
she's a very successful you said talk about her that see again all the same mistakes are being repeated okay woman she worked as a principal uh, for around 30 years and uh, she is very positive person full of energy and whenever i feel uh, down during my uh, uh, lifetime i usually uh, consults with her Cons she give me perfect I advice usually, and motivates me i usually consults with her is wrong i usually consult her okay okay I consults with her okay to do something great in my career and uh, she are she also uh, tells me that there will be lot of difficulties in life lot of mean lot of okay but you have to face them I but i have to face them okay okay it is reported speech. Okay, you're getting it wrong. Okay. Don't be negative about anything. And not to be negative. Okay. So I think she makes me feel. She makes me feel. Okay. Uh, energetic and positive about the life. So about life, not the life. Uh, she is the person uh, who motivates me. That's all. Man. Very nice. Not bad on the whole, but uh, your pronunciation will not let you get a good uh, good score in this. Okay. Okay, ma'am. You you made up. You picked up the cue card, new cue card. You had collected ideas on your own, and you spoke on your own. That's pretty good. You can also say that she's an excellent cook. Whenever I go, she makes yummy snacks, and she 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 makes them in minutes. Okay. So, okay. you know, welcomes nicely. Welcome me, welcoming me, khater dari me, khana pina hota hai na? Yes, yes, ma'am. So, uske baare me you didn't say. Thik hai? So, you okay. can say that, uh, you know, um, I am very slow in the kitchen, but she's so quick. Uh, once I went with five of my friends and uh, every one of them enjoyed her tasty dishes and snacks. And she was so, uh, you know, overjoyed and she made us feel so welcome. Okay? Okay, ma'am. That you can say a person who welcomes. We like to go to her house again and again and again. Okay, like that you can say. Okay, good. On the whole, well, well spoken. Who is next? Ma'am, should I go? Yes. Oh. Why, why not? Skill when you learned as a teenager. When you were a teenager. Skill, skill you learned or enjoyed as a teenager, right? You can start. Okay. So, uh. There is one skill that I want to talk about, which I only like enjoyed in a teenage, and it was cooking. I remember that I joined an academy in my hometown. It was for my one month to learn about the basics of uh, uh, cooking and everything, um, and also about learning different uh, dishes and recipes. So it was uh, when I uh, so I. Uh, in the academy, they taught about about different things like different uh, food items and uh, how to make them, and from the very basics that what ingredients make food so delicious and about the details of it, what brings the tastes from curries to uh, pizza uh, soups and also desserts mm -hmm. and cakes and baking. Everything I learned over there, and uh, whatever I used to learn, I enjoyed learning, and I used to try everything at my home and make for my family and they were very happy about it that at least they get to eat something nice and delicious at home and uh, they used to praise me whenever uh, if, the thing, uh, if anything turned out so good so I remember that I tried uh, once a banana bread in which only only a few ingredients are needed like you know, like a plain flour uh, uh, a plain flour uh, two or three bananas uh, egg and a baking soda cinnamon powder and um, you just mix all of the, them and bake it. So, uh, and I also added dry fruits because they are like healthy. Uh, so, uh, and it, it turned out very, and I just bake it for 180 degrees, uh, degrees Celsius for 40 minutes and it turned out very good and everybody really liked it. So when uh, whenever they have, I had a, a, any gathering at my home of my friends or family, anybody, I used to make banana bread for them or any other dish. So, they uh, really praised uh, uh, praised me for that, and uh, I think it is very healthy. So they really like to have it with tea. And okay. uh, just two minutes, okay, good. So we did. We don't yet have the cues below, but you did a good job, Saman. That was very nice. I'll just give a feedback. Very occasional, 
minor uh, errors at a couple of places i'll let you know okay uh, there is one skill that I want to talk about, which I only like enjoyed in a teenage, and it was cooking. I remember that I joined an academy in my hometown. Uh, it was for my one month to learn about the basics of uh, uh, cooking and everything, um, and also about learning different uh, dishes and recipes. And so it was uh, when I uh, so I. Uh, in the academy, they taught about about different things like different uh, food items and uh, how to make them, and from the very basics that what ingredients make food so delicious and about the details of it, what brings the tastes from curries to uh, pizza uh, soups and also desserts mm. and cakes and baking. Everything I learned over there, and uh, whatever I used to learn, I enjoyed learning, and I used to try everything at my home and it for my family and they who were very happy about it that at least they get to eat something nice and delicious at home and uh, they used to praise me whenever uh, if the thing uh, if anything turned out so good so i remember that i tried uh, once a banana bread in which only only a few ingredients are needed like uh, like a uh, plain flour uh, uh, plain flour uh, two or three bananas uh, egg and the baking soda cinnamon powder and um, you just mix all of the, them and bake it. So, uh, and I also added dry foods because they are like healthy. Uh, so, uh, and it, uh, it turned out very, and I just baked it for 180 degrees, uh, degrees Celsius for 40 minutes and it turned out very good and everybody really liked it. So when uh, whenever they have, I had uh, any gathering at my home of my friends or family, anybody, I used to make banana bread for them or any other dish. So, they uh, really praised uh, uh, praised me for that, and uh, I think it is very healthy. So they really like to have it with like it. like to have it, okay? Like to have it, yeah. They yeah. liked pass aage na to have it. Yes, okay? yes, sir. Yes. And right. uh, it is two minutes. So that was, I think, the only mistake, and very good. It is uh, you are natural. And, 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 and every time you use, you can give a pause and start begin a new sentence with less, some less yes. apps in it on the yes. whole good, okay? But that is yeah. a way of speaking. I think that I read somewhere that in the I'll speaking, if you give too many ands, it doesn't matter because generally people speak like that, okay? Natives also speak like that. Yes, who is next? Ma'am, may I? Uh, yes, of course. Why not? Which one would you like to speak on? Unusual uh, treat. Holiday. Unusual holiday? Yes. All right. Start. I am a person who likes traveling very much. I like traveling so I can explore many places uh, to, and also know about their cultures and also know about the peoples. So today I would like to talk about one incident which happened uh, to me last uh, vacation. I went Cox's Box, Bazaar and it was pre-planned. It was not pre-planned. Uh, in the last winter vacation, I was scrolling my Facebook and uh, suddenly I saw one offer from, from one resort. It was 50% discount. So I immediately called my cousin and luckily he was free also. So we met, uh, we booked the resort and booked the ticket to go to the Cox's Bazaar. Uh, in Cox's Bazaar, there is a sea beach, which is the longest sea beach in the world. So I never uh, before go for the, uh, never see the uh, sea beach before. So we visited there. So on the day when we reached the resort, we were welcomed very warmly. And the resort was very beautiful and it was nicely decorated. And uh, the other natural beach was very uh, pleasant for us. So we stayed there. There we enjoyed a lot of things. Like we uh, enjoyed the paragliding. That was the first time for in our life. And it was a very amazing experience for me. Then we also visited the coral uh, island, which is which was also new for me. We took a lot of photos there and we enjoyed much. And that was the, my first air journey, uh, air journey also. So I enjoyed that journey also very much. And after this, uh, we uh, returned to home. So as I took many photos, when I see the photos, I can uh, recall those memories and this give me a good pleasure. And this is the this is the unusual tip uh, we I made. And uh, this was uh, not pre-planned. All right. 
All right. So, uh, Sabir, on the whole, a good attempt. Okay. So, what was unusual in it? Uh, Ma'am, as it was pre-planned, that's why. It was not pre-planned. Okay. It was not pre-planned. That is why it was unusual. Okay. Yes. So, you should begin. When you begin, you say, normally, whenever I go on a holiday, I plan it well in advance. Okay. But here I'm going to talk about an unusual holiday because it was absolutely unplanned and it was on the spur of the moment that I and my, my friend and I decided to go. Okay. So, it was... Yes. So it was unusual for me. Okay. So like that, okay. you it was unusual. Right. Okay. I'll tell yep. you for your pronunciation errors. And you know, again, last time you spoke. Yes. And what did I tell you? Uh, grammatical error. Or... Apart from that. Uh, some vocabulary or something. I said that uh, you should articulate well. Some things are yes. not clear when you speak. Okay? Yes, ma'am. Did I say that to you? Right? Yes. It was better than last time, but still there are certain places where I would like to ask you, what have you spoken? Okay? If that is the case, then you have to be even more clear. Okay? Now let us listen. All the others uh, who are with me here, who are attending this class, while I repeat his uh, speaking, we are all acting as examiners. You will note whatever mistake. If you note the mistakes of others, you will not do those mistakes. Okay? So, I depend on you for helping me in the feedback. Yes, ma'am. I am a person who likes traveling very much. First mistake is I am a person that is singular, a person who likes traveling. What is the mistake here? Anybody? I like traveling. Who likes traveling? Uh, I am a person. Person singular ho gaya, likes traveling. I like traveling is okay. Okay? But I am a person who likes traveling. Okay? Likes I. Got it, Sabir? Yes, ma'am. I like traveling so I can explore many places uh, to, and also know about their cultures. and also... Not cultures. Culture. Okay? Know about the peoples. So today I would like to talk about one. It's instance. not today. It's today. And then people. It is just people, not. Yes, us. it's not peoples. It's people. Very good. Thank you. Okay. And which happened uh, to me last uh, vacation? I went box boxes bazaar and it was. See, I couldn't make out where you went. Could, could anybody else make out from what he said? No, no. ma'am. No. See, Sabir, what did you yes. say here? I went to Cox's Bazaar. Which, which bazaar? Cox's Bazaar. Spellings? C O X. Huh? Um, B A J D R. Huh? Cox um, Bazaar. I... It is Cox Bazaar. What is Cox Bazaar? You said Cox's Bazaar. Oh, ma'am, sorry. Is it COX Bazaar? Yes. So it's Cox Bazaar. Okay? It was not clear. Planned. It was not pretty planned. Uh, in the last winter vacation, I was scrolling my Facebook and uh, suddenly I saw one offer from one uh, resort. It was 50% discount. So I immediately called my cousin and luckily he was free also. So we met, uh, we booked the resort and booked the air ticket to go to the Cox's Bazaar. Uh, in... Again, you said Cox's Bazaar. Ma'am, it's uh, COX apostrophe says space Bazaar. This is the COX apostrophe? Yes. Yes, Cox's Bazaar. Okay. But then, you know, it, it has to be clear. Yes, there is a sea beach which is the longest sea beach in the world so i never uh, before go for the uh, never see the uh, sea beach before i had never before ever been to a beach but that is all okay i had never before ever been to a beach okay 
So we visited there. So on that day, when we reached the resort, we were welcomed very warmly. And the resort was very beautiful and it was nicely decorated. And uh, the other natural beach was very uh, pleasant for us. So we stayed there. There we enjoyed a lot of things. Like we uh, enjoyed the paragliding. That was the first time for in our life. And it was a very amazing experience for uh, me. Then we also visited the coral uh, island, which is which was also new for me. We took a lot of photos there and we enjoyed much. And that was the, my first year journey, uh, well, year journey also. So I enjoyed that journey also very much. And after this, uh, we uh, returned to home. So as I took many photos, when I see the photos, I can uh, recall those memories and this gives me a good pleasure. And this is the this is the unusual tip uh, we I made, and uh, this okay. was uh, not. So it was better than last time. Just at a couple of places, I could not make out what you said. Um, minor pronunciation errors also, but that is okay. Not great, not too many. I would say definitely it is a, a six point five. Okay, good. Who is next? May I? Uh, yes. Okay, a skill you enjoyed as a teenager, right? As a teenager, yeah. Right, okay. As soon as I saw this topic, multiple skills has popped up in my mind, although some of them has put a bad impression on my mind and soul, and some put me in a greater air. I would like to talk about one such skill that I enjoyed as a teenager. I vividly remember uh, uh, at the time of COVID pandemic, I was getting bored, so I asked my mother to teach me how to cook at first it was really daunting for me because I don't know the nuts and bowls of cooking but uh, when she explained each and everything uh, to me I simply grabbed it and I also watched different types of videos on YouTube and after some time when a guest arrived and my mother was not well so at that time I uh, made chicken curry for them and uh, once i put all the spices which is required in the chicken curry the guests uh, once eat it and they were really amazed of my cooking because they are not envisioning such type of uh, things from my side and it was really delicious they also appreciated me and uh, they also gave good compliments to me and my mother was really happy because she was also not expecting this type of uh, thing for, uh, from me. And it was really uh, amazing time for me. And I feel that I improved that skill uh, with the help of YouTube and from uh, with the help of my mother as well. And uh, it is very beneficial for me in my earlier uh, uh, life because if I will go to... Uh, some other place and I will surely make different yeah. types of right. cuisine for myself. Nikita, Nikita, two minutes. All right. So, Nikita, I'm going to give you the feedback. <laughs> okay, ma'am. After the feedback, you will decide whether the very first sentence that you spoke was needed or not needed. Okay. 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 As soon as I saw this topic, multiple skills has popped up in my Multiple skills has popped up. Skills is plural. Has is wrong. Okay. And as soon as I heard this topic, time is implied. Has ya have kuch aana hi tha. Popped up in my mind. Okay. Mind. Although some of them has put bad impression. Although some of them has put. Ab kya skills bad impression dalengi? Mujhe batao. Like agar kisi skills mein achha nahi kiya ho, to wo uska bad impression. Bad impression. On your mind. Itni ratti hui line lag rahi hai kahin se. Kahin fit kar rahi hai aapne. My mind and soul. And some put me in a great oh, hey, yeah. Some put me in a great? Oh. A-W. Oh. Yeah. I would like to talk about. Ab ye jo aapne sentence dala hai na. Ye jo pehla sentence dala hai na. Agar aapka overall cue card saath hai na. Is sentence ki wajah pe chhe pe jayega. Okay. 
और अगर छे है तो पांच पे चला जाएगा सीधा ही ओके बिकॉज इट इज लुकिंग सो मार्क्ड अप इट इज लुकिंग एज इफ समी एज टॉट यू दिस लाइन एंड एज टोल्ड यू इसको घुमा फिर आके उस क्यू कार्ड में फिट कर दे बिकॉज इट वॉज नॉट नीडेड हेयर ओके समन को मैंने सेवन दिया उसने सीधा कहा से शुरू करा है देखा आपने yes, such skill that I enjoyed as a teenager, I vividly remember. This was a seven seven band beginning, जो ये सेंटेंस था दिस वॉज ए सेवन बैंड बिगनिंग यू डिड लॉट ऑफ एफर्ट to bring that beginning down to a 5.5 or 6 which was not needed right yes ma'am uh, uh at the time of covid pandemic i was getting bored so i asked i was getting bored kabhi bhi bore nahi hota bored hota with a d okay i was getting bored okay so my mother to teach me how to cook at first it was really daunting for me because i don't know the nuts and bolts of cooking but uh, what do you mean by nuts and bolts of cooking <clears throat> like bana matlab idiom hai ye all right i wouldn't use it but i i'm not stopping you from using it but i wouldn't use any idioms like that okay Okay. I did. I mean, I at first it was daunting because I didn't know anything about cooking. Okay. Explain each and everything uh, to me. I simply grabbed it, and I also watched different types of videos on YouTube. And after some time, when a guest arrived and my mother was not well, so at that time I uh, made chicken curry for them, and. Uh, once i put all the spices which is required in the chicken curry the guest once eat it and they were really amazed of my cooking because they are not envisioning such type of uh, thing they were not envisioning and envisioning okay Yes, from my side, and it was really delicious. They also appreciated me, and uh, they also gave good compliments to me. And my mother was really happy because she was also not expecting this type of uh, thing for uh, from me. And it was was really uh, amazing time for me. And I feel that I improved that skill uh, with the help of YouTube and from. And I felt that I had improved my skill with the help of YouTube. Okay. The help yes. of my mother as well, and uh, it is very beneficial for me in my earlier uh, uh, life. अगर earlier life की बात करनी है तो it was very beneficial. बोलो. ओके या बोलो दिस स्किल इज वेरी बेनिफिशियल फॉर मी बिकॉज नाउ आई कैन कुक आई कैन कुक अप डिशेज इन मिनट्स आई डोंट टेक टाइम ओके एंड आई आल्सो लव एक्सपेरिमेंटिंग ओके आई विल गो टू सम अदर प्लेस एंड आई विल शॉर्टली मेक डिफरेंट ऑल राइट सो निकिता वो फर्स्ट सेंटेंस में दो तीन मिस्टेक्स आ गई हैं हैव यू हर्ड वो रिवावत आबेल मुझे मार हाँ वो अपने करा है सारा सेवन बैंड पे था उसके अलावा मैम फिर वो मैं ना यूज बिल्कुल नहीं यूज करो कोई जरूरत नहीं है साढ़े आठ बैंड मेरी जो स्टूडेंट क्या है उसने ऐसी सिंपल इंग्लिश बोली थी मैं आपको बताऊ आप हैरान रह जाओ कोई इडियम नहीं कोई कुछ नहीं सिंपल इंग्लिश फ्लॉलेस नो ग्रामेटिकल एर बिकॉज इट वॉज सिंपल इंग्लिश शी फोकसड ऑन हर वे ऑफ स्पीकिंग ओके Yes, Manish. You are. Yes. Ma'am, what are the newer topics? I joined late today. These are the newer topics. They are going on. Okay, just attend the class and then you can see the recording. Okay. 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 All right. Who is going to speak next? Ma'am, me. Me. Lakshmi first and Neil next. Okay. Okay. Just thank you. One second. Just give me one second. Um. Last uh, Christmas, ma'am, unusual uh, an unusual holiday. Uh, just give me one second. Just give me. Don't start. Okay. Give me one okay. second.
yes now you can speak lakshmi yes ma'am uh, an unusual holiday okay. um, last christmas i had interest to go somewhere but uh, i could not uh, get holidays uh, hol but i could not get holidays from my workplace uh, so i said my husband that i want to go somewhere um, because i am uh, because uh, i am getting bored so my husband said okay you can take permission from your um, workplace and you will go um, i asked um, in my uh, uh, senior I asked to my senior staff. They said, "Yes, you can go three days holidays." Um, it it was not my pre-planned holiday, but I want to spend some time. Uh, uh, I want to spend some time with my family. So same day, which day they said to me, "You can go that day only." I made ticket to go Nepal, and in Nepal, one one of my friends. She's staying and uh, she's staying and same day um, which I got um, permission from my office, same day I called to her, I'll go uh, to your house and she said, yes, you can come and uh, the aeroplane ticket was free for me because my husband is working in uh, an aeroplane, aeroplane company. So, as, so, um, Next day, um, we start, started our uh, uh, visit. Next day, we started to uh, go to Nepal. And after I reached, my friend helped me a lot to visit uh, his uh, her area. Um, and she knows all, uh, all those uh, famous uh, tourist place. And as a guide, she took me many places where I enjoyed right. a lot. Lakshmi, it is more than two minutes. All right, Lakshmi, you spoke uh, well. I would tell you, uh, I would guide you that if you have to make this an unusual holiday, you have to say something why it is unusual. So in this holiday of yours, you can say it was unusual holiday because normally we spend a lot of time when we go on any holiday. But this holiday was literally free. Okay, so it was unusual, and we I I traveled by air. My air ticket was free because my husband works in the in an airline company, and then my stay was free because my friend stays in Nepal, and my uh, my uh, you know sightseeing was free because my friend took us around. She's working as a guide, mm -hmm. so like mm -hmm. that you can say, and that was a uh, that that made that holiday unusual because at the end of the holiday. I had spent only 500 rupees from my pocket and it was a huge big holiday for me and we had done so much in that holiday. So it was unusual. Mm -hmm. From some aspect, it should be unusual. Got it? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, ma'am. Now, now I'll play back and tell you your pronunciation errors. I think you are, you have found difficulty. The first student who spoke today could not speak the sure and you are making... Yes, yes, madam. I have the same problem. Yes. <laughs> I know. Sh you have the opposite I mean, problem. She, she, yes. You are using shares too much. Okay. Yes, yes. yes. I know that man because... That is because of the place you stay. I think yes, everybody yes. There says, says share more. Rasgulla, we say, they say Rosh. <laughs> yes, ma'am. That is... Yes. It. I tried a lot to speak like this. She, she, but I never can. Means I never speak. Yeah, um, last Christmas, I had. It is not last. It is last. It is not Christmas. It is Christmas. It is all sir, not sure. Okay. Just to go. See here, you should avoid these words. You can say last year. Okay. Oh, you okay. can say in, in, in November. You can say in December. Try to avoid the shows. But uh, I could not uh, get holidays. Uh, but I could not get holidays from, from my workplace. Uh, so I said my husband that I want so to I, go. I told my husband. Okay. Somewhere. Um, because I'm going to... Now because uh, I'm getting bored. See, it is never bored. It is always bored. Last student also spoke bored. So I corrected her. It is never bored. I'm feeling bored. Okay? 
my husband said yeah. okay you can take permission from me my husband told me that i should take permission from my workplace and then we would we could go um workplace and we will go i asked um in my um uh, uh, senior i asked asked nahi hai lakshmi it is asked okay asked my boss okay my senior staff they said yes you can go three days i asked my seniors and they allowed me a three day holiday okay they allowed me a three day leave okay holidays um it it was not my pre planned holiday but i want to spend some time uh, uh i want to spend some time with my family i want to nahi i wanted to spend some time with my family okay so same day which day they said to me you can go that day only i made ticket to go nepal and in nepal one you can that day only i made ticket to go nepal and in nepal one one of my friends she is staying so you can say i planned to go to nepal and in nepal there is a, a friend of mine okay who's who's working as a guide tour guide you can say like that and as uh, assisting <coughs> and same day um which day i got um permission from my office same day i called to her i'll go so you same day same day you say the day i got permission i called my friend and uh, she was happy to uh, to welcome me. she was happy to uh, know that i would be meeting her okay Uh, to your house and she said yes you can come and uh, she said yes you can come is direct speech na no? you have to say in the indirect so she uh, she said that she was happy that we would be coming there and that we could uh, stay with her okay the aeroplane mm -hmm. ticket was free for me because my husband is working in uh, aeroplane aeroplane company it is not aeroplane company it's an airline company you can name the company which company is working in oman air so you can say my husband is working in oman air so we got the free tickets right so okay as so now next day um, we start started our uh, um, visit next day we started to uh, go to did you are making it very lengthy you can say the next day we reached nepal Okay, it was a one-hour flight or a two-hour flight. You can say like that. Okay. Okay, my dear. Nepal. And after I reached, my friend helped me a lot to. So, ah, uh, my my friend showed me around, and we stayed with her. We enjoyed with her. I spent time with my husband. Both of us are very busy. We hardly get to spend time with each other. But those three days we were together. So that was. Uh, a very nice and beautiful holiday for me make small sentences okay and um, mm. uh, speak fluently and improve your shares and so okay that is mm. you have to work on it make a note of all the words it stand from mm. the and don't think the in the place okay like that all right okay, who's speaking next may i hartik hartik ma'am may i yes After that, Sunil, your turn. Okay. Okay. Start. <laughs> There are many people in my country who welcome to others by doing some different types of activities or work. Here uh, today, I would like to talk about a person who is very good at making people feel welcome in home. Her name is Jaya. Actually, she is my paternal aunt, and she lives in Noida. Last December, I decided to go there. Uh, i also wanted to give uh, uh, give her a surprise i did not inform her before leaving my house when i reached there i uh, she got surprised and she also felt the top of the world because and she hugged me and told me that uh, told me that uh, it is a very wonderful day and a wonderful day and you made my day the best and uh, after that she suddenly uh, went to the kitchen and started to cook food for me such as vegetarian and non she cooked vegetarian and non vegetarian food and uh, it was really very spicy food 
and in the evening we went to have a dinner and next day she took me in a uh, in a shopping mall actually uh, my aunt uh, doing a business we always stay okay, busy okay. in her it's 2 minutes okay oh sorry okay. i stopped you in between i'm sorry mujhe laga 2 minutes okay. hai it's only 1 minute you can go okay. on uh, okay uh, first let me give this much feedback and then i'll give you the rest of the feedback okay ma'am okay ma'am okay. i'm sorry for that there are many okay. people in my country who welcome to others by doing some dip welcome is not followed by to welcome others okay okay ma'am types of activities or work uh, today i would like to talk about a person who is very good at making people feel welcome in home her name is jaya actually she is my paternal aunt and she lives in noida last december i decided to go there uh, i also wanted to give uh, uh, give her a surprise i did not inform her before leaving my house when i reached there i uh, she got surprised and she also felt the top of the world because and she hugged me and told me that uh, told me that uh, it is a very wonderful day and uh, it, told me that it was a very wonderful day reported speech galat ho gayi okay wonderful okay, day and you made my day the and you made my day ni and that i had made her day okay okay ma'am and uh, after that she suddenly uh, went to the kitchen and started to cook food for me such as vegetarian and non she cooked vegetarian and non vegetarian food and uh, it was really very spicy food and in the evening we went to have a dinner and next day she took me in a uh, in a shopping mall actually uh, my aunt uh, okay i'm sorry now you and uh, you okay. can continue for one minute okay more. Just... okay ma'am yes start actually my aunt is doing a bu- uh, business and uh, she uh, she is uh, stay always busy in her business and uh, i felt very happy because because uh, because of uh, her busy days she uh, she get a lot of uh, time for me and uh, she is uh, uh, actually she is very i'm sorry again mere se pata nahi beech mein cut ho raha hai i felt very happy because despite being very busy she gave me all her time okay Okay, okay despite being very okay, busy, she gave me all her time i'm sorry her free it has happened no no ma'am it's okay <laughs> okay this is actually uh-huh. my aunt is doing a uh, business and she uh, she is uh, stay always busy in her business she is stay nahi she she is always busy in her work okay okay ma'am but despite being busy she attended yes ma'am despite uh, i felt very happy because Because... and you know because 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 you said three times it is not because okay join your lips okay. and say it's because 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 not yes. because it's the b purse your lips join your lips and say b because because yes now it has come out well all right um, harpreet next time okay we've given you enough feedback who is next Manish, me, ma'am. Yes, Sunil wanted to speak. Yes, Sunil, you are. Yeah. Yeah. My topic is, ma'am. I don't think this. The teenager skill. Is, your voice is breaking. <clears throat> Start. My my topic is the teenager skill. Yes. It is generally says that teenage is the most. important learning is for a person in order to flourish their future in a good way well rather it is a tough topic for me because i have learned a lot of skills in my teenage but today i would love to talk about a skill which i learned recently it is a matter of one years back when i studied in class 12 uh, during my summer vacation i decided to learn swimming uh, i got admitted in uh, in a swimming academy which was milestone away from my home and initially it was a daunting task for me how to swim uh, i learned all the basic skills of swimming within 15 days after that i participated in a state level championship and also won the gold medal and uh, uh, these skills changed my life profession uh, in a good way and now i am a national champion of swimming and 
and this is the skills which i find uh, most important in my life which changed my life whole all right all right so you spoken 1 minute and 17 seconds sunil let me play it back in the skin yes it is generally says that teenage is the most it is generally says that is wrong it is generally said that okay potent learning is for a person in order to flourish their future in a good in order to flourish their future is wrong in order to um in order to do well in their future in order to flourish in life flourish if okay. to flourish in life flourish their future is wrong okay 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 so there was no need of this sunil i just okay. give one student a feedback that please stop making such beautiful lines to begin because uh, they really take pull your uh, you know overall band score down because you tend to make mistakes in such beautiful complex sentences which you put all your hard effort to make okay okay well rather it is a tough topic for me because i have learned a lot of why is it a tough topic for you you have learned so many skills you have to speak one of them why is it tough why do you have to speak such things sunil okay because i um, aake maine bata bhi to rakha i have learned a lot of skills in ah, my so, teenage so i have learned a lot of skills and i here i am going to talk about this skill that was it okay yeah okay skills in my teenage but today i would love to talk about a skill which i learned recently it is how old are you now yeah ma'am How old are you now, Sunil? Yeah, I'm twenty years old, man. Twenty. Recently, and uh, recently, and teenagers till which age? I learned uh, thirteen to nineteen. Nineteen, nineteen. Okay, recently, yeah, chalega. But I think just say that in when I was in tenth uh, or twelfth, you can say okay. One year back, when I studied in class twelfth, okay. uh, during my summer vacation, I decided to learn swimming. Uh, I got admitted in uh, in a swimming academy, which was milestone away from my home. And initially, it was a daunting task for me how to swim. Uh, I learned all the basic skills of swimming within fifteen days. After that, I participated in a state level. championship and also won a gold medal and uh, uh, this skills changed my life profession uh, in a good way and now i am a this skill changed your life what my life profession ma'am profession yeah ma'am okay champion of swimming and uh, and this is the skills with... so how did it change your profession Uh, Sunil, expand on that. Can't hear, can't hear. Okay, so you can say that now I am working as a swimming instructor. You can say that, and I am deciding to pursue this as a career in life. You can say that. Okay, that would be good. Now I am a good swimmer, and I am a nationalist champion. Okay. Yeah, so you can say that I'm. I have decided to adopt this as a career now. So this is a skill which yeah. has changed my life altogether. Okay, and I learned okay. at that age. Good. All right. Yeah. So the speaking class is over. I hope you all uh, enjoyed today's class. All of you did very well. I must say. I must say no, that. What's about my speaking? Uh, who is this? Harpreet. Harpreet, we you spoke very well. Thank you. My feedback. Okay, Sunil. I find uh, most important in my life, which changed my life. All whole. right, all right. So I gave you the feedback, na, that you spoke well on the whole, but I couldn't understand how it changed your life. Okay, oh. and you spoke one minute fifteen seconds. You have to go on for two minutes, so you have to add oh. ideas. Okay. You can say okay. you can start. You can start without thinking of the first line. You can start. I have learned many skills as a as a teenager, but here I would like to talk about one skill which has changed my life for 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 good. 
okay and this skill is swimming okay oh, so earlier yeah. i was very afraid of water but then you know one of my friends wanted to learn swimming in a swimming academy which is near my house so i also okay. joined initially i found it very tough but then i started enjoying it okay i would like to i would love to go to the you know uh, uh, that academy again and again and ultimately i started taking part in some competitions and i started winning and that boosted my confidence okay and it also okay. uh, made me fitter you can say it's a very good exercise I... okay you can say it also made me more fit okay like that you can okay. say so it has changed me i used to be a bit on the healthier side but now my body is very fit because i am a regular swimmer and you know i practice every day like that you can say very well i think all of you have done very well today very nice and um, let's um, let's hope by tomorrow or day after the new file complete file will be out and uh, uh, but I'm sure that uh, the way you spoke today, all of you, without even knowing these cue cards beforehand, you've done a very good job of it. And I'm sure you will, uh, uh, you know, do the new cue cards very nicely once they are out. So all the best to all of you. And my uh, GT, how many GT students are here? One is Sunil, I think, right? No, you are academic okay manish you are gt or academic i am also academic okay anybody who is a general training student here yes me kulvinder call kulvinder oh hi kulvinder how are you your sister just yes. called me okay okay so yes i'll, thank I'll you. start the class in uh, in another 5 minutes okay take a 5 minutes break okay Okay. I'll I'll re-log in. I'm ending the class now. Bye for now. Thank you, ma'am.